everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with another reading, which is going to be for all of you out there who are dealing with a cheater, and you know that they have been cheating on you, they have been lying to you, but you can't stop loving this person, you really want to know, will they ever stop cheating on you or not? Let's find out. Just be mindful, that's a general read, it when it not resonate with everyone out there, pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see, will this person ever stop cheating on you? You do have Ten of Swords. Six of Cups. Wow. Two of Coins. Queen of Wands. Queen of Swords, Knight of Coins, the Devil, Four of Swords. I mean, the deck we do have the Seven of Swords. Well, to be honest, I feel like you know, for those of you who have seen your person walk away from you to be with another person, with the Ten of Swords, I really feel like you know they are definitely gonna get hurt by that person badly at that. I really think that you know whoever this person is, that they are you know probably cheating on with you. Um, I really feel like you know, this person has or will be going through a lot of traumatic events with that person. Now, maybe they have been having that serious relationship with another person or other than you. And uh, they are definitely going to have to go through immense pain. I really think that something really 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 bad is going to happen with them maybe they have gone they are gonna like you know maybe they trust someone so bad you know it seems like you know the karmic reward for them i feel like you know the way they have hurt you the way they have cheated on you they are gonna get cheated on by their person is what i see here with this card which is gonna make this person realize that you know you were so innocent you were so loving you were so genuine to them which is going to make this person nostalgic about you so that will be it for them you know after this happens with them which i really feel like you know it's going to happen very soon for majority of you this person will feel that you know they need to be with you they will realize your worth they will realize that you have always been a very good friend to them as well you know let alone that you know that that physical relationship or that loving relationship that you have but just as as a friend to nobody can beat you, nobody can compare to you, which is going to make this person realize your true worth. I really feel like, you know, right now when we are doing this reading, probably they are still under the influence of, uh, you know, that, that uh, you know, attraction that they have of other people uh, coming to them. They, they feel like, you know, as if they are the boss or something. They treat you bad. They treat you like, you know, they mistreat you, in fact. And I really feel like you know, they feel tempted to kind of like, you know, have affair with other people. But soon, something really bad is going to happen with them. That experience is going to make them realize your worth. So I really feel like, you know, if something is happening where this person has been pulling away from you and getting too attached to somebody else, they are going to come back to you. And that too very soon. I feel like, you know, for some of you, the seventh month is going to be very significant when this person take a U-turn towards you. And they are right now as well, I think for majority of you, they can sense that they have made a mistake they have made a wrong choice and decision in life but they find it hard to accept it as a fact so i really feel like you know for some reasons i feel like you know your person has fallen in love with the third party here um they are too attached to that person but that person is not attached to this person here the, that is the reason why they're gonna handle the situation this way because they will now realize after going through the pain and suffering that they are going to go through, they will realize that how hard it was for you to let this person go when they cheated on you. And I feel like, you know, they will then understand that, you know, they made something, you know, they made a mistake. They, they did something really, really wrong to you. That's going to make this person come back to you to apologize. Um, but it is going to take time. I feel like, you know, the seventh month could be significant when this person is going to take action towards you. And uh, even now, they, they know that something has, like, you know, kind of, like, you know, got out of control for them. And they can sense that there is something wrong. And they're still trying to kind of, like, you know, manage this relationship with the third party. But they are not going to be able to handle it the right way. Um, I really feel like, you know, they have, like, a lot of stress. They, they, they don't sleep at night peacefully. Uh, they think a lot about you already, but 
um, it is not going to be easy for them to reach out to you or to come back to you forever because they will know that, you know, you know what has happened there. They know that, you know, you know what has been going on in their personal sphere. And uh, you would know that, you know, why they are coming back to you. It's not because they love you now. It's just that they have learned the lesson with the third party here. And the lesson and the value that they, you know, I feel like, you know, you couldn't make this person realize you love them. You couldn't make the, this person realize that you are worthy of their love too. But that other person is going to make them realize your worth. And I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, when this person comes back to you, you would not be so attached to them at all. I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, um, this person will leave the third party forever and would never go back to deal with them at all. Be that the same person or be that any other person, they would never repeat the mistake that they did, which they are now regretting. And uh, But having said that, to be honest, you will not be able to trust this person. I really don't think so. I really feel like, you know, you, you would be like the one getting the charge of the situation. Um, you will be more... Um, you know, you will be having the upper hand, I would say. The ball is going to be in your court. Do you want to give the visit, this person a chance or not? I really see that for majority of you, because of whatever happened between you and them and the way they cheated on you, it's going to be very hard for you to trust this person. Even though I think that, you know, when they come towards you, they are going to be like genuinely wanting the two of you to be back together because of the experience that they've had. And also after realizing your, you know, your love was genuine, it's it's something which this person is going to kind of like, you know, want, want to kind of like, you know, risk uh, losing. This person will make the effort, try to win your, you know, um, your heart try to win your trust, try to win your faith in them again. But I really don't think it's going to be an easy situation for them. They are going to be consistent with their effort in this relationship now onwards when they come back to you uh, with, with this ending, with that learning. Uh, but at the same time, I really don't think that you will be open to accept them willingly, uh, you know, to, to, to give them a chance even. I really think that you will have a tough time to give this person a chance and, uh, but yes, seventh month is going to be the time when this person is definitely coming back to you. Um, and they would want to apologize. They would want to get back with you. It is going to be your situation. Do you want to give them a chance or not? Um, I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, you're going to definitely take your time. I really don't think that it's going to be a big, big yes from your side when they approach you. You would want to be so sure why they're coming back. And because of the past that you've had with them, it is going to be tough for you to believe them. Because, you know, once a cheater, always stays a cheater. That's how you are going to see and view this situation. But I really think that they wouldn't do that because they have learned the karmic lesson. They have learned the lesson the hard way. Um, and once they are shattered, now they would never make you go through the pain again because they have seen the pain, they have dealt with the pain and they wouldn't do it again to you. So that's what I see coming in for you for this read. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. Till I do the next read, take care, bye.